Hi, Alex. Welcome back to our channel. I have another review video here on this paper that I bought from Wish using their credit that they gave me. So I decided to purchase some heat transfer paper because I want to start making t-shirts and, you know, put in uh, different designs and different things. So I bought this paper and this, I got 50 sheet and it's the sublimination paper. It's eight by five by 11 and it's for inkjet printers. So you're supposed to print your image onto this paper and then uh, like use a heat press and transfer your image onto, you know, your um, your t-shirt. So it says you can put it on t-shirt, mugs, mouse pad, iPhone case, totes, glass, and a variety of other items. So we're gonna try to see if it works. I'm just gonna use a t-shirt today. I'm gonna use a dark t-shirt and a light t-shirt to just to see the difference between the two. And this product was $8. I'm going to also insert a picture of the products and put a link in the description box if you guys are interested. Okay, so I just printed this off of my inkjet printer and I'm just gonna cut the image out and then I'm gonna try to put it on a t-shirt. Okay, I have the image cut out. I didn't do it on my Cricut because I know a lot of people don't have a, like a Cricut machine. So I just did it on my regular inkjet printer and I just printed any image. I just got this image from, from Google. So let's go ahead and I'm gonna use my Mighty Press. This is a t-shirt press. And I have Angelo's t-shirt in here already. And what you do is you just lay the image down. And then you use a piece of parchment paper. And then you just close this. I'm gonna get some help. And then you close it. And then you leave it in here for a minute. And once it's done, this machine like beeps and then you, le you let it cool for five minutes. So we're gonna let it sit for a minute. Then we're gonna you hear that sound? That's just the machine saying that it's ready. All right, you see that steam coming out of there? So you gotta be really careful with this machine. I'm gonna take the, the, the parchment paper off and we're gonna let this cool for five minutes. So I'm gonna let it cool off. Okay, it's been about five minutes and this did not work at all. The image is still attached to this. It did not transfer at all. And I did use an inkjet printer. Okay, since I tried a dark color shirt and it didn't work, I'm gonna try a light color shirt. Here are the printouts again. And these are from my inkjet printer. I put them on here. I'm gonna use the contact paper. And then I'm gonna close this down. Okay, so it's finished. It's been a minute. And I'm gonna let it cool down for like five minutes. I'm just gonna take this off. I'm gonna let it cool off and then we'll be right back. Okay, so it's been about five minutes and let's see if anything happened. Nope, nothing happened. So I tried it on the dark t-shirt. I tried it on the white t-shirt and absolutely nothing. So this paper is not working at all. So outlets, you guys just see me try to put this uh, product onto the t-shirt and it did not work. It was a complete fail. I don't know if I did something wrong. They didn't send any instruction, but I did go on the Wish website and I scrolled and uh, swiped the pictures. And then I got to a picture where there was like four little images and it said, that you have to print the picture like choose your image print it onto here using your inkjet printer which i did and then you have to use a heat press to transfer the uh, images over to your t-shirt which i did it did not work it was a miserable fail for me so i don't know if i did something wrong but i did what it's said to do on the website 
I have to give this product a zero because it did not work for the purpose of what I bought it for. So unfortunately, this was a fail. And if you guys now have any suggestion or if you know a better way for me to use this, please let me know because I hate to give products a bad review if I'm doing it wrong. But I did it the way it said for me to do it. And I still have the image, both image, both image are from inkjet printers and none of them work. So thank you guys for letting me share. Um, if you have any question or any comment, please let me know and I will bring, we'll be bringing some other review video on some more products that I received. Thanks again. And please like and subscribe for more videos. Thank you.